Hi! So lately I have been watching a ridiculous amount of story time videos. It's actually a little alarming to myself and others around me. But it's made me start thinking about the fun stories in my life. So today I'm gonna tell you about how I had dentures as a child. Yes, child dentures. It's just as sad as it sounds. In my youth, I had horrendous teeth. My teeth were bad when I was in first grade. By bad, I mean one tooth was crossed over the other tooth. My family started calling me a demented bunny. I didn't know what demented meant, so I just took it all in my stride. One thing led to another. I started a trend in my class. We were a group of demented animals. It was a thing. A bad thing, but a thing. Luckily, my dad is an orthodontist, so I didn't really have to worry that much about it. I had braces in first grade and second grade, and then I got them off. My teeth went on as normal, living their little lives, when suddenly, these two teeth fell out. And that is when my parents decided to bestow upon me the knowledge that I didn't have new teeth to grow in there. That was it. Physically, no teeth to come in. They were just gonna be gaps. This occurred around fourth grade. Luckily, my creative pops had a plan. He glued my two baby teeth onto a retainer, and I wore that retainer every day. But I still took it out for eating food, so I'm really not sure who I was fooling. Sometimes the baby teeth would break because one's teeth, like, fall out of your mouth, they stop being strong. So that was always fun because I'd be late for school in the mornings because I had to get my dentures fixed. It was just the strangest problem to have. Like, who has that? Why? That was a thing for me. I had to put in my dentures every morning, and I was 11. Of all the experiences in my life that I attribute to having character, that is one of the greatest ones. But you know, what was I gonna do? Have these two giant gaps? I was like, 11. I didn't want to look seven. Please, I was too mature. So I wore this denture retainer thing every day in fourth grade and fifth grade, but at some point, this had to end. I could not go on like this forever. I got braces again. These teeth are actually my canines that have been pulled in. The only place that any of this was cool was at the dentist, because they thought it was a nifty contraption. Side note, I still go to a children's dentist even though I'm 16. It's getting out of hand, but they love me there. It's a great time. I don't bite them. They give me a sticker. They ask me if I'm gonna be applying to colleges soon. It's great. <laughs> Tragically, I cannot show you the actual retainer, which I still have because when I was 13, I put it in a time capsule because I thought, what more would I want to dig up than my baby teeth stuck to a retainer that I wore for two years of my life? So yeah, in July 2023, we'll get to see all of that garbage. This is so dusty. 13-year-old Rachie packing up the old denture retainer for the memories. Thank you for watching. Do any of you guys have weird teeth stories or maybe you had the trials of a 73 year old when you were 11, you know? Comment down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.